protect your home from home. Simple Caravan Insurance, sponsors of the Caravan Channel. Now let's head over to the Camping and Caravanning Club site in Oswestry. This is the Camping and Caravanning Club site at Oswestry, Cranberry Moss campsite. We are eight miles from Oswestry and 13 miles from Shrewsbury. The campsite itself has 64 pitches in total. We have 38 hard stand pitches with electricity. There are 17 pitches which are grass with electric and the rest are standard pitches and we also have a backpackers area as well. A lot of people come to our campsite for many reasons. One, uh, just to relax. It's nice and quiet, the wildlife, birds always tweeting and singing. Uh, there's plenty of walking from the site and the local area. We have a bridle path from the entrance as well as the country park which is just two miles away and there's plenty of canals and cycle routes as well as looking at the local towns and villages uh, in and around the area. You're close to Shrewsbury mm -hmm. and you're close to Oswestry mm -hmm. which, is, uh, which is handy. There's a bus leaves the site just outside or you can go four or five mile up the road and join the uh, park and ride. Oswald Street itself is a market town which really brings in the visitors with uh, local farmers markets and uh, local traders that they have there as well. Uh, it's a very quaint uh, little town. We didn't realise how much was there. They, we were told on site to look and go all these little tiny passageways and all the little alleyways and it just kept on going and going and going. It's a fantastic place to come. So why not come back again? There's also Chirk Castle is nearby. There's quite a few National Trust properties as well. Whittington Castle is another one uh, that a lot of people go to see. Uh, in Oswald Street itself, there is Park Hall, which is a very nice uh, Victorian farm, uh, which is great for kids and adults. There's um, pig racing, there's a maze, there's all sorts of things to see, whether it's sunny or raining. I think that people enjoy coming to our campsites because it is peaceful, it's quiet, there's plenty of things to see and do at the same time. Um, you can take, you can sit back and relax or you can get involved with the things that are going on in the area as well. Well this is our first time we've come to the site and I initially chose it because uh, I was doing a cycle race last night and this was very close to the cycle race and also there's a horse show tomorrow on in Shrewsbury which is near to here. Um, so we thought we could combine them both because I'm into my bikes and my wife and uh, child into their horses. So that was the deal. We have one facilities block on site, our main facilities block, which has uh, gents and ladies toilets and showers, as well as cubicle rooms in there. We have essentially heated inside dishwashing facilities, which double up as information boards and tell you a lot of information that's happening in the area as well. We have a, a laundry with a washer and dryer as well as disabled facilities with a parent and child room as well. Last night after I'd done the bike race, I came back about, I think it was half past eight, nine o'clock, went to the shower block and uh, lovely clean showers and real nice powerful hot shower, which is just what I needed. <laughs> Our service pitches have electric hookup, which is 16 amp. We also have various service points around the site, which have dustbins and water points for drinking water and grey water. At the site entrance we have recycling bins uh, which we collect mixed recycling, bottles, plastic, glass, cardboard and newspapers which are collected um, to raise money for the local parish. This is a very dog friendly site, um, especially dogs that have well behaved owners. Uh, we have two dog walks, we have the on site dog walk which is a little nature walk, it's enclosed and dogs can be let off the lead in there, have a bit of a run or there's a bridle path straight from the site entrance, which is really nice for walking dogs. And as well, we have a couple of dog-friendly pubs in the area, uh, one which is just at the bottom of the country park. We have one barrier on site, which is opened at seven o'clock in the morning and stays open until 11 o'clock in the evening. We have visitors car parking at the top of the site and for any late arrivals, they can park there as well and easily walk around the site back to the vehicle. You're treated like family. You know, or, or we certainly are, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, you know, yeah, um, yeah. and this time we've been here something like three weeks. Yeah, just over. You know, we left so the van and had to nip home. And Gail and Alan and Peter looked after it for us. 
So, you Just know, for diesel. a couple of days and yeah, then yeah. we came back, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so it's, it is, it's, it's, it's like a family run site, um, which is very good, really. Every new year, and as well for our site birthday in August, we put a marquee up uh, where we have fun and games. We have horse racing, bingo, deal or no deal. Uh, it's fun and games and a social supper uh, where everyone can get together and just have a, a good old tin wag. I think people would love to come here, mainly because it's a nice, quiet, friendly site. Uh, you always get a warm welcome with us because we are a family site and we appreciate everyone who comes and, and enjoys the local areas, whether it's just to sit back in the sunshine or have an adventure in the local area. It's a family-run site that they own and they've got to make it go. It's their living so therefore they're going to put as much into it as we are going to get out of it. The more they put in, the more we're going to get out of it. And of course, people like that is going to make it safe for us to be able to stay on and always come back to. Because we're going to feel safe, we're going to enjoy it, so we're going to come back to somewhere we are going to be safe. Yeah, we're happy campers in. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> well, if you too want to be a happy camper or caravanner, then why not head down to the calm and relaxing atmosphere at the Camping and Caravanning Club site in Oswestry, where you'll be greeted by the friendly and welcoming staff.